Legends of vampiric figures date back to ancient Mesopotamia, the lands of the Assyrian and Babylonian empires between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers. There, a demon goddess, Lamestu, whose name means she who erases, terrorized villages and homes at night, preying primarily upon babies, whether in their cribs or even in the womb. Lamastu was also known to feed on the blood of men and torment them in their dreams, even causing sterility and disease. These legends gave rise to those of the Lamia and Strigis in ancient Greece, creatures with the upper body of a beautiful woman and lower body of beasts. As with Lamastu, the Lamia, who were part serpent, and the Strigis, who were part carrion bird, preyed upon babies and children, stealing them away and drinking their blood. In more modern Greece, a person that has been excommunicated from the Orthodox Church has committed suicide or has suffered a violent death may become a Vrikolakas. This reanimated corpse has the ability to leave its grave every day but Saturday. The Vrikolakas will knock on doors and call out the names of those inside. If a person responds, he or she will die soon thereafter. The Vrikolakas grows more and more powerful with age but can be killed by a stroke of lightning or fire.